Alright, first of all, I'd like to thank GM for taking our custom Silverados and making them safer and better than they ever have been before. Love the new grill. This one's waiting to get its black work steps put on. Of course, everything's going to be blacked out on it. Let's go over some of the features that are going to be different from this year than they were our previous year, like that one right there. Let's start up front. Of course, the grill is completely different. Liking it, that bow tie right there is going to be blacked out here in a moment. The headlights. The way it's all like one solid piece instead of two on the inside looks like they got some uh, carbon fiber look in there very nice hoods pretty much the same check out the key on this one because now we have push button start you get a better key that uh, actually looks a lot like the new Suburban and Tahoe keys. Very nice. Instead of having a key fob and a key hanging from it, now you got a two pieces in one. Of course, the bed still drops down automatically, but now standard in your bed is a nice 120 volt, 400 watt power plug there. That's now standard. And of course, everything else you see with the LEDs, that's all standard um, previous models also. Let's check out the inside. Of course, right off the bat, get a 10-way power driver's seat with lumbar control. Awesome upgrade, because now, before when we had a shorter driver's, it couldn't sit in the custom and drive comfortably. You got the IntelliBeam headlamp system on it where you push the button and of course when you're going down a dark road it's going to automatically turn off and on your high beams for you. So yeah, it looks like they installed the button right there. Um, let's see here. What else is going to be new? Of course, it always came with cruise control. Oh, the under seat storage. Of course, it has a storage still in here, but underneath the seat you now have lockable storage. For all your goods everything up here looks the same except there's another 400 watt plug right there for you and like I said before it's the safest safest custom we've had uh, because now they come all standard from custom and actually, actually all of our Silverados this year with the Chevy safety. With Chevy safety assist, which means you get the automatic emergency braking, forward collision alert, front pedestrian braking, lane keep assist with lane departure warnings, following distance indicator, and of course the IntelliBeam that we spoke about. So this is the safest and best custom Silverado GM has ever made so far. Same 2.7 liter turbo engine, but with the upgrades they did to the engine, it's got the same horsepower, but now it's got up to 430 pound feet of torque. That's up from only 348 from previous year models. I would say that's the pretty much the predominant changes from previous year to this year. You no, know, like previous year, this year. Of course, this one back here is a double cab, but you know that is the 2022 LTD, and of course, this is the official 2022. So yeah, let me know uh, if y'all like what they've done to the customs. I know that, of course, LT and above Silverados are going to have the nicer interior, but I mean, for an entry level truck to have this much equipment on it, standard, 
uh, to me that just blows me away. I thought they were great before and they made, you know, some of the gripes we had before and, and you know, I would say they definitely cured the uh, short person wanting to drive one of these and not feeling comfortable or even the tall person now they don't have to sit up so high with that adjustable seat to me that was huge but uh but yeah leave in the comments below which uh features you like best about the truck whether it's the grill and some of the changes they did on it and uh if you'd like to see more of these videos don't forget to leave a thumbs up and subscribe